Hey there, it's Michelle and welcome back to the show. I am going to be doing something a little different today. I want to invite you, anyone you know who might need more grounding, a feeling of hope, feeling of connection to one another versus a lot of this division that exists right now. There's so much fear and anxiety and it's not going to go away anytime soon. That's very clear to me. Um, Data is changing every day on the virus. There's just anxiety is ratcheted up to such a high degree. And I was thinking this summer about how we are all connected. So you may or may not believe this, but I truly believe and feel deeply within myself that we are all energetically connected. We are one. And so when you hear the news of people dying in India and in Africa and other countries that don't have access to vaccines, we cry because of our connection, our humanity, our knowing that it's our fellow brother and sister. And what I'm interested in creating today and through a series of very short solo casts and some guests, I want to focus on how to ground us, how to expand the love that we have in our hearts for humanity, for one another, for healing. I believe that collective energy impacts what happens in the world, that our fear expands and creates more fear and love expands and creates more love. And so today is just going to be an invitation to come into a place of love um, and to remember that and to feel it, even if it's just for one minute, one minute of just calm, peace, serenity, and hope. And I will be doing uh, a few of these um, as a little bit of as an experiment, but also as something that I feel like I needed. And I will invite you to share this with others you feel need this as well. So what I'm going to invite you to do today is to close your eyes, take three breaths in through your nose and out through your nose to center and calm your body. So we'll breathe in and out, in and out. And in and out. Take a moment to feel your body right now and how much more relaxed you may feel. I know I do just from three breaths. And anytime you're feeling overwhelmed, you can do this. Now I want you to sit comfortably, whatever that looks like for you. You can even lie down. Put your hand on your heart. Take a moment to get connected to your body. Any areas that may feel tight, uncomfortable, have pain. I want you to take a moment with your hands on your heart and with a focus on your breath to send love to those parts of you that are just feeling uncomfortable. Now, take a moment to think of someone, could be a pet, some experience in your life that brought you joy, a happy time, a happy place, a happy experience. And I want you to bring that picture in your mind so clearly of that person or that pet or the experience that you feel every cell in your body radiating with that joy. So take a moment now to bring it into your mind. Think of that person or the pet or the experience with your hands on your heart and with a focus on your breath.
And let that feeling of love expand. Let it radiate to the parts in your body that feel stiff or tight. Let it calm your anxiety, your worries, just for this moment. Trust that all is well and that you are safe. Now picture that feeling of love that you're feeling for whatever you brought to mind and give it a color. Whatever color pops into your mind. If it's just a white light, then it's a white light. Now imagine that light expanding from your heart as bright as the sun and surrounding your body in a circle of protection and peace, of calm, of love. And continue to just breathe gently, basking in that love and that safe space, that love circle that is surrounding you now, that beautiful light. Now from your heart space, from that circle, imagine that light spreading to everyone in your home, in your community, in your state, across the country, and around the world. Imagine that beautiful light of love encasing the earth. Imagine that this light has the power to heal, to protect, to give you comfort when you need it. And take a moment to breathe in through your nose and out through your nose. And with your hands on your heart, consciously send love to every soul on this planet. You can think the word love, you can feel it. Now imagine that beautiful light that you pictured encompassing the earth, radiating out to the universe, to the stars, Take another breath in through in and out through your nose. Now bring your consciousness back into wherever you're sitting or laying down. Bring your awareness into the room where you are. Take a moment to think of one thing that you're grateful for in your life and allow that to bring more love into your heart and imagine that the love that you just sent out to the entire universe to every soul on this planet is returning love back to you and bask in the loving feeling, knowing that we are connected, we are one. And 
and that we are loved. Okay, when you're ready, open your eyes. And again, take a breath in through your nose and out through your nose or mouth, whatever's comfortable. And take this grounding energy of love and connection to one another and let it guide your day. I know that this is a very, very different episode that I've ever done, but it just, the idea just kept coming to me and I wanted to share my love for all of humanity with you and to invite you to do the same and to remember that we, we are connected and things are very noisy right now and they will continue to be, but you have a safe space within your own heart and in your body to ground at any time to bring peace to your day, to your moment, to your reality. We all have that. And I'm sending all of you love and good and well wishes and great health and all that is good to flow into your life. I hope you enjoyed this. Feel free to reach out to me. If it was at all helpful, you can do so at at hello at thegoodlifecoach.com. Okay, my friends, stay well, and thank you for allowing me to share what was in my heart today. I'll be back with you next Wednesday. Bye for now.